Left-wing coalition candidate Andrés Manuel López Obrador has made security a linchpin of his electoral campaign. Seventy people are murdered every day in Mexico. That's 400 people a week. Fewer people died in the earthquake. From the beginning of the campaign, border polls have shown that López Obrador has an advantage of between 18 and 20 points from his closest rivals. In the latest poll, published 10 days before the first debate, He's been once again placed first. Vamos a Mexicans need to make peace with each other. No more hate, no more grudges. We need peace. Strategies attempting to damage López Obrador's image have included infiltrating agitators during public events to initiate violence, like what happened outside the venue of the first debate. Another weapon being brandished against López Obrador is an alleged documentary that has no release date or distribution channel, but which has been heavily publicized all over Mexico City. The adverts show López Obrador next to Latin American leaders who have been called populists by the right wing. The presumed creators of the documentary have complained about being censored, which provoked a response from the Morena party. We strongly believe in freedom of speech. We want to know who's behind this publicity. Asking where the money comes from is quite different than censoring. Since 2007, electoral law limits the amount of advertising that can be purchased on traditional media, which has led to the so-called dirty war on social media. A digital research firm has identified that up to 30% of political content in social media comes from fake accounts. 